Hi guys, 18 Dap here and welcome to the latest match day vlog. It is a big one. It's Doncaster Rovers versus Grimsby at the Eco Power Stadium in League 2. Let's get the video started. So guys, welcome to this match day vlog. Big one, Donny versus Grimsby, both steady starts to the season. Grimsby yet to win away from home, so you know what that means in this one. Um, if you want to hear my thoughts in a little bit more detail about this fixture, go ahead and watch the match preview. I'll link it in the top corner of the screen um, and let me know your thoughts on that in the comments down below. If you're an existing subscriber though, thank you so much for supporting the channel. If this video has brought you to the channel, please consider clicking subscribe so you don't miss any future content. Uh, usual format, we get down to the ground, we're nearly there now. Um, talk to the family, get their thoughts, see if we can get a couple of fans from both teams to give their opinions on the season so far. Um, I'll then give you the confirmed team lineups. Um, we'll see how close I was on my fan up prediction, and hopefully, you guys have downloaded that app and you can see how close you are, hopefully, earning some points so that you can get rewarded for following your team. Um, and then, hopefully, capturing some celebrations in the home end this time. A big bounce back from Salford. 3 0 defeat midweek would be nice and will get us back on track a little bit. So, looking forward to this one. Hopefully, entertaining for both teams, but ending in a Rovers win. Let's get into this one. Let's get the family's thoughts. Uh, Max, what we're we going with? Obviously, we want to bounce back from Tuesday, don't we? Yep, it was that terrible. <laughs> I don't know, it, 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 it weren't bad. I think we've got to blind, man. Yeah, I think, I think we've got to take into consideration a, a threadbare squad and an illness that went through and stuff, so not a bad performance, but it could have been better. Yeah, poor, poor result. Are we going to bounce back today? Yeah. What we're we going with? 2-1, uh, Donny. 2-1, one, I've gone 3-2 to Donny. Uh, Chris, what we're we going with? I'm going to go for a 2 0 Donny. I think uh, we'll be back and uh, yeah, need to get a clean sheet. I can't say he's getting a clean sheet, but we'll we'll go with it. So yeah. 2 0 Donny, 3 2 Donny, 2 1 Donny. Yeah, 2 1 Donny. Yeah, there we go. So my dad's just pulling up, we'll get his thoughts next. Um, so nice and quickly, I've gone 3 2 to Donny. Chris has gone 2 0, Max has gone 2 1. Um, Thoughts on Tuesday first? Uh, Tuesday, I thought we were lucky to be fair. I mean, they, they came with a job and did it. Uh, big man up front, get the ball to him and give it in depth, and that's what, that's what they did well. But, uh, to be fair, it could have quite easily been 3 3. Yeah, it yeah. We crossbar twice, and then uh, old Iron Slide, as we now call him, had one disallowed when he were clearly onside. And you can't really compensate when you get officiating like that. Yeah. I thought it was tight. Watching it back on Twitter, obviously, cam, camera angle, you can't really tell. I think you need to be dead on. Yeah, yeah. But I, I, I thought he was marginally off. Did you? After, wa after watching it back, initially I thought he were on. But yeah. that shows how tight it was. Yeah. Um, but no, it's, yeah. but it's what it is. I mean, That's to be fair, one. that line on Tuesday night. Flag happy, wasn't he? Oh, yeah, he was tweeting to get it up, wasn't yeah. he? <laughs> 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 hang, hang on, it's, it's still in our side, you silly get. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's still in our half. On to so, this yeah. one. Um, on to this one. I'll go, I'll, still, I'll stick with 2 2. Gone with Desmond. Yeah, I'll go with 2 2 because we're in similar positions. Yeah. It's a local derby, they're hard to call, so um, I'll go for 2 2. I'll, I'll be ecstatic if we come away with 3 points from it, but I'll be happy if we get Me too. Right, so I'll go with 2 2. Lovely stuff. We've got Grace. It's sent in here. Hello. What we're we going with? Two Score one. prediction 2 1. Yeah. To Donny. To Donny. Yeah. Hopefully you're right. You've not, <laughs> we've not lost since you've come, have we? No. So well, hopefully, good luck. hopefully you're a lucky charm. Yes, I am. We will see. I there am we go. Lucky charm, <laughs> Great. Um, I think Max has got some mates that wants to give a uh, score prediction as well, so let's get to fans' thoughts. Group of Rovers fans um, want to give a score prediction for fans' thoughts, so we'll start from the left hand side. Um, what, what are you thinking today, mate? Uh, I'm thinking. 3 1 or 3 2, Donny will take that. Go on, Pop. Yeah, I'm saying 3 1, Donny. Oh, confidence, I like it. 2 1, Donny. 2 1, Donny. 2 1, Donny. 2 1, Donny. 2 0, Donny. Hopefully, all you guys are right and it's three points and we're back on, bro. Yeah, yeah. Lovely. Cheers, lads. Yeah, yeah. So, got a, go, uh, a couple of, of, of Groomsby fans here with us. Um, if you just shout your names out from, from left to right for us. Marshall. Yeah. Rachel. Rachel. Finley, thank you for taking a little bit of time. Uh, first question, how do you think the season's going so far? Obviously, both teams kind of languishing near the bottom of the table. We both need an upturn in form, don't we? Uh, yeah, we've not had a good run just lately, but we've got to get behind them because we are supporters and we're here for the thick end of it. That's good, that. I like yeah. that. Would you agree with that? Yeah, I'd say that's, yeah, I'd say that's spot on. Yeah, get yeah. behind them today, try and pick them back up yes. and get the win we deserve. Lovely stuff. Um, in my preview, I've gone with Danny Rose as a one to watch, but you guys watch your club week in, week out. Is he kind of the target yeah. man or is there somebody else that we should be watching out yeah, for? I reckon he's, that's right, we used to have 
Yeah, Danny Rose. Yeah, Danny Rose and Issa. Let's get him back on there. Issa as well. Yeah. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> um, I'm hoping that we bounce back from midweek. We got beat 3-0 by Salford. Hopefully we do bounce back. I've gone with a 3-2 win. I think it's going to be entertaining for both teams. Uh, just give us a score prediction, please. I'll go 2-1 Town. 2-1 Town. Yeah, 2-1 Town. 3-2 Town. Lovely stuff. I hope you enjoy your day at the Eco Power. Uh, try the food. It's absolutely banging. Okay. Cheers and safe journey home. So here with Charles, quick score prediction for today, mate. I'm going to go 2-0. There'll be a reaction today after after Tuesday, and I think Grant McCall will get those players fired up. There we go. Lovely stuff. Hopefully you're right. <laughs> <laughs> Big thank you to the fans in Fan Sports for getting involved. Really appreciate that. Confirmed team lineup for the Rovers. Louis Jones in goal. Tom Anderson, Luke Molyneux, George Broadbent coming in. Tom Nixon, Owen Bailey, Joe Ironside, Jack Senior, Zane Westbrook, Ben Close and Mo Farr. The bench, Ian Lawler, Olawu, Biggins both going out from Tuesday. Deji Satona, Kyle Hurst coming back from injury, which is nice to see. Jack DeGrucci and Jack Goodman. Let's see if that is the starting 11 and bench that can get us three points today. Come on, boys! into the net but what he's done is he's thrashed it he's gone over um, a very evenly contested game at the minute um, scrappy yeah scrappy no team with real quality holding on to the ball um, and yeah it's been a long 24 minutes but the numbers are starting to grow into it a little bit still nil nil save what a save it's a big opportunity for Groomsby there, ball play through and it was a wonderful ball and uh, I think it was Danny Rose beating Tom Anderson for pace. Uh, he's tried to slot it to Louis Jones's bottom left and a really good strong hand tips it around for a corner. Um, one big chance each really in this half. That's about it, still 0-0, 39 gone. Steady first half where neither team's really created that much of note. Um, I think you can tell it's two teams that are struggling towards the bottom end of the table. Uh, not a lot of confidence, the, the ball's not sticking to either team, it's very scrappy. Um, and we just tick into the 49th minute, four minutes added on, it's still nil nil. Um, I'd say Rovers have probably been a little bit more confident and composed on the ball. Um, but yeah, nothing to show for it yet. Big second half coming, Rovers nil, Groomsby nil. Let's go watch second half. Big second half. Yeah, we're, just, we're just too inconsistent to be to be real contenders for top seven, I think. Yeah. 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 Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Something! second half much brighter uh, than Donny a good opportunity there he's, he's called offside I'm not sure if it went in or not it looked like it bounced off the post and, and stayed out from, from this far out but Grimsby fans celebrating I think it was Danny Rose celebrating as well um, celebrations cut short 54 gone still 0-0 we need to get back in it go on Ben go on Kyle A penalty to the Rovers, great ball through. Kyle Hurst has gone through and tangled the legs. I think it's a stonewall penalty. Ironside's picked it up, but. He's been limping yeah. for the past two minutes. Yeah, he's been limping, he's still hobbling about. Come on, Joe. Stay on this one. Joe Ironside, come on. Steps up. Come on! 
little bit more on the penalty that's put us 1-0 up. Um, Joe Ironside stepped up, we thought we'd been limping for a bit, we were a little nervous, but he's beat the keeper who's gone the right way, beating with pace, accuracy, uh, very good penalty once again. So 1-0 to the Rovers, we're on 80 minutes now. Uh, and Grinsby have just started to throw absolutely everything at us, put us under quite a bit of pressure. Uh, but we're holding firm for now, 10 minutes to go, still 1-0. Big result this. to put this game to bed 84 minutes 84 minutes and corners come in he's gone all the way to back post both bars there and I don't know how he's headed it over from on the line um, but yeah, just his long legs there he's just cut the ball out from keeper he, he's a weird player to watch you can see that there's quality there and skill but he just looks so clumsy uh, but yeah he could, he could have done anything other than what he did and it would have gone in back at net and been 2-0 and potentially game over but Grinsby they're pushing for this, they're going to turn the screw for the next six six minutes plus. Hopefully we can all out, we'll look dead on his feet once again. Um, 84, gone. 85, gone. 1-0 to the Rovers. We've seen it. Yeah! Oh! 92 minutes gone, we're in to five minutes of added on time. Um, and Rovers have hit the bar once again, that's three times in two games. Uh, ball played from the corner to the edge of the box where Bailey's hit it. I think it's a good save, tipped onto the bar. But it's still end to end. I'm not, I'm not liking it, I just want us to manage this game out. We're still 1 0, 92 gone. Going to finish up in the car, Rovers 1, Grimsby 0 full time and I think on the balance of play probably a draw would have been a fair result but we will take those three points, valuable three points I think as the season goes on. Um, great travelling support, the atmosphere kind of kicked into life when, uh, when Grimsby hit the post um, from both sets of fans and I think we just had a little something, Kyle Hurst coming on. Um, just gave us a little bit of energy um, but I thought, I thought we defended really well uh, defended as a unit managed the game really well when we went 1-0 up Grimsby did put a lot of, a lot of pressure on us um, but didn't really create from the pressure that they were putting on um, so yeah very happy with that one uh, on to the next game I think next game is FA Cup um, and then we're back into, into league action after that so yeah it'd be nice to have a bit of a break um, hopefully get a few more players back because these players coming back from injury will feel like new signings I think Kyle Hurst gave us a little bit of that today um, so yeah very very happy Ooh, exciting stuff that's where I'm going to leave this one I hope you've enjoyed it if you have please stick a big thumbs, thumbs up on it for us please comments in the section down below subscribe if you haven't already as always thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one